been about a week since I made a video, according to uh, YouTube. Well, it's probably been a little bit longer, but sorry for the breeze. But figure I'd show you what's going on. Uh, anyhow, picked this up yesterday, and we have oil all over the place now. This is cute little 307. I got it just for the crank because it's a 327 crank. And some other cool parts. I might make it run. I don't know. Let's see if we can get it unseized. Done it before. But we're going to be doing some stuff to this pickup. I got a wire loose on it. Never really showed you the interior, but that's kind of what it is. Hood. So I need to unload that engine from the back. And I need to do take the suburban wheels off so I can do something with them. And I need to figure well I know how, it's just a pain in the butt to adjust the idle on this. Idles too fast. But this is our old small block Chevy. 100% stock. It's a 210 horsepower crate engine replacement on it. So, but anyway, we're gonna play with it a little here next weekend or so. But. We'll come over here. I'm gonna play with a throttle bike. Had a leaf spring fall on my foot the other day. Kind of being a pansy about it. Walking around, oh my poor foot, way up way up. No. Uh, let me get this throttle bike. We had a little oil mess last night. I'm adjusting the valves on a pickup. That's pretty fun. Uh, it's a mess, but it's cleaner. I better turn the radio off here in a second. Oh well. Can't really hear it. It's water. Huh. Strange. Okay, but this is one of the little TBI intakes. With a cam. What's that cam? That cam box is empty. That's the cam in my big block. But what is that one out of? I don't know. But anyhow. To rebuild kit. This is a, just a cute little Rochester TBI with a bent air cleaner rod thingy on it. And they make these so that way, well, you aren't supposed to adjust them, but you hit the stud on them like a moron. Hold on, let me get this stupid thing out. Anyhow, there we go. They have an idle adjustment right there. Butterflies, but GM plugs them. So, I don't know how to get it out. But we're sure going to try today. So we're going to pull that off. I end up just pulling the stud out. But, I'm going to play with it and something or I might play with my big pickup I'll probably end up doing that actually but let's see where the mood strikes us well that was easy enough see kids this is why you go to money or go to school so you can have money to get toys like so and have a shop that they fit in nah I know I'm so a kid myself but still you get the point Anyhow, TBI. Cute little thing, isn't it? I actually kind of like them. Well, I like them. Because it's not stupid EFI. 
but I'm too dumb to tune a carburetor yet until I get a chance to play with one more. Anywho, uh, we're just in the idle. Like I was saying really a little while ago. Uh, the person that owned this before me has already taken the plug out. So I might use this throttle body just because of that reason. But I'll give you a little hint what we're doing. Well, obviously. It. I have water pump coming. Uh, go to Jags for stuff. I, I like their stuff. I just used to not like it, but then I actually looked at it. It's like, huh, Amazon for car guys. Like hot rod car guys. What the heck? wonder how long that's been there. Oh, I bet that's to plug a vacuum leak. Do I have a vacuum leak? No. Huh. Silly Mexican. Dude, I bought this from. But this thing idles a little bit fast. So. I can't tell. What's in there, though? I'm guessing Allen or Torx. I don't know. Let me play with it, and if I figure it out, then you'll watch me set my idle down a little bit. I'm sorry, my camera lens is dirty, by the way. But, I know that I looked at it, actually, where I could see it. The plug is still in it. I'm kind of lazy about changing it. I think I'm just going to do a, a different throttle body. I'll pull the plug out of the other one and put it on there because it's the same thing. I bet all of you know how these work. I'll show you kind of the basics. <laughs> kind of like fuel injected carburetor. No, that probably don't make sense, but it makes sense to me.